What's up with the gang? What's up with the squad? What's up with my tater tots? Y'all already know who it is. It's your girl Tanaya Janae, and I'm back again with another video. Today is going to be another ghetto gourmet with Tanaya Janae, honey. Yes. And we are going to be making some hot Cheeto crusted mozzarella sticks, okay? And if that don't sound ghetto, then I don't know what sounds ghetto, honey. But that's what we're going to be making today. If you're on my page and you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. Turn and post notifications on. Like, subscribe, comment. Yeah, I already said that, but whatever. Do all of that. Follow me on Instagram, lay with four A's, and let's get into this ghetto gourmet with mwah. All right, Tater Tots. So the ingredients that I will be using today for this video is, bam, we got us a little bit of that good, lovely Creole seasoning from Tony. Uh-huh, mm-hmm, whatever that say. Creole seasoning, bam, get it out of the way. Then, we have us some black pepper, okay? We're gonna keep the seasonings easy because it's just mozzarella sticks and we need all that extra stuff. Bam, get out of the way. Then we have us some lovely eggs, large eggs. I like the big eggs. One, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna use the other eggs for breakfast, so we're only gonna use one of these. Bam, put that thing in there. Get out of my way. Then, the next ingredient, we have our lovely, snuggly, Bam! Flour, y'all already know what it is. Y'all know what's going on. Gold metal flour. Bam, get out of the way. Then we have our extra virgin olive oil. Hot plate. Bam. I already have some in the um, deep fryer. I'm going to be deep frying the mozzarella sticks, but this is the oil that I use for the deep fryer, I think. Mm -hmm. Then we have our next ingredient. Our flaming hot Cheetos. Bam, these were like my favorite chips as a kid, but not no more. But these are the chips we are going to be using, so let's get started. I don't know how I forgot the main ingredient, y'all, but we got our string cheese right here. Mozzarella sticks, these are the ones we're going to be using for these. Um, hot Cheeto mozzarella sticks. We're going to take our flour and pour it in this bowl. We all got a bowl that look like this, okay? So don't argue with me about my bow. Argue with your man. I'll take a little bit of flour. Pour it in the bowl. I just spilled all of that flour, y'all. That's way too much. We're gonna pour some back. We don't waste it around here. Mind y'all, I've seen somebody else do this video. So I've seen them season the flour. I know it probably makes sense to season the egg, but I'm gonna season the flour because I'm just gonna do what I see. So now I have a food processor. If you are a loyal Tater Tot fan, and y'all been watching my videos and y'all been keeping up, y'all seen when I had did the giant DIY Cheeto puff and I didn't have a food processor. I put the Cheeto puffs up in a plastic bag and I was just like, <laughs> Beating it and beating it and beating it. But today, today, baby, we got us a food processor. Now, I don't even know if this thing works. Because this button don't seem like it, it works. But I'm going to try to put it together and let y'all know if it works or not. Well, that's so, so tragic. Of course, it's always going to be a struggle. That's the whole point of the ghetto gourmet, okay? So since that didn't work, y'all, I'm going to try to put... The hot chips in the blender. We got our famous blender right here. And we are gonna see if that works. I'm gonna only try a few again because I wanna eat some of these, okay? So let's see. I think that's enough. We're gonna pour this much up in there. And we're gonna see how this thing works. Oh Lord, y'all. This is why it's ghetto gourmet. Fingers crossed, y'all. Please. Oh! Whoa. Add a little bit more. And I don't need that much, because I'm only doing four amounts of rubber sticks, y'all, so. Just add a little bit more. This is the 
best we gonna get, honey. All right, y'all. Open these bad boys. Drop that sucker up in there. Drop that sucker up in there. So we got one. Bam, bam. So we're gonna dip this up in the egg. I should have got a different bowl for this. It ain't trying to go up in there, y'all. It is not trying to go up in this bag, honey. Oh, it's gonna go up in here today. y'all different angle there we go oh look at that look why is it smoking that is weird y'all like literally i don't know if y'all seen it on here but when i opened this up that thing started smoking Okay, y'all. This is crazy. This is how they look. Um, yeah, this is how they look. I don't even know if these babies is done or not. The cheese is sticking. The cheese then came out of the mozzarella stick. Oh my god. It ain't no cheese up in here. Oh, 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 oh. Uh uh. That's what we ain't doing. We just not playing these games with nobody. So I'm about to take these out and just give it a little taste. I'm glad I only did three because as y'all seen, this just got ghetto real quick. Okay. But as far as taste goes, taste wise, let's see. Okay. They low key nasty, if we're being honest. I should only did one. I should only did one. Look at this one. This one ain't even got cheese in it look at that barely it's like completely empty let's taste it without cheese goodbye you know the flat one actually the one without cheese actually tastes good because it really just tastes like the deep fried chips let's see Let's see. I don't really know how to feel about these. Because the thing is, y'all, 
they ain't nasty or nothing but they just like don't taste like anything they don't really taste like hot chips they don't really taste like mozzarella it just tastes like you're eating something and you don't know what you're eating like you can't describe the taste okay i'm done i'm not gonna keep eating these because it's gonna make my stomach hurt this is the mess i just made Well, there you have it. A Ghetto Gourmet with Tania Janae episode two. This one was definitely ghetto. The first one with the salmon croquettes, that wasn't really all that ghetto, just quirky though. But this, ghetto, big ghetto, big flop, big L. That is it. If you like this video, thumbs up it. Comment, subscribe, turn your post notifications on. Follow me on Instagram, lay with four A's y'all. I'm about to clean up this mess. I really don't feel like it, but whatever. I'm about to wipe these counters down, spray it, wash these dishes, throw everything away. And that's it for this video. I will see y'all on my next one. Mm -hmm.